When I was growing up in Accra, my father died when I was nine, and it was my mother was the only one uh, bringing in any income. It was very important for me and for my sister to be able to study and be able to get scholarships, uh, because that's the only way we could educate ourselves. When I was growing up in the 60s, we heard uh, President Kennedy's speech. He talked about uh, having man land on the moon. And then in February 1962, we heard on the radio also that John Glenn circled the earth three times. This was very exciting, and that gave us more interest in doing science and technology. Bell Labs recruits worldwide, so they came to Imperial College where I was to recruit. So I decided to come over to the U.S and see what is happening in Bell House. 36 years later, having come to uh, this country, I and my colleagues worked on some video coding and video encoders and decoding that was used to record some of John Glenn's second space flight in 1998. I didn't know that I would even be doing something like this in the future. I had good mentors throughout my, my career and I always know that uh, if you want to see far, you have to stand on somebody's shoulder. And so it's very important that I can uh, have a strong shoulder for others to stand on and be able to encourage them to do even greater things than I have achieved.